Rabasse kete yerebe sorobo shata yaraba. Orebe si katarabashe yerebe sotorobo raba yaraba. Orebe satarabashe te. Orebe sa yaraba. Orebe asaraba yorobo. Rebe sakata yerebe sorobo sete. E rebe yaraba. Robo satarabashe te. Rabakoto yorobo sa. Father. Lord, open the heavens. Release the host of heaven to wage war against our enemies. Release the host of heaven, Father God, to uproot generational altars by which we go back to the scene of the crime. We go back to the original incursion. And Father God, we break and undo what our forefathers have done. We erect altars of holiness and righteousness unto you, O God. We pound asunder with the sword and the hammer of the spirit and we destroy all hewn stones by which blood was shed and by which possibly Posterity and generations were offered to for wealth by which food was offered to appease demons. The blood of babies have been offered to appease demons. And Father, we break, we undo, we destroy, we annul, we annihilate, we obliterate, we incinerate God. Anywhere these things are on our bloodline, on our lineage, anywhere they're following us, anywhere there's a dossier, God, of documents, Lord, that gives the enemy the legal right. As we have repented for the sins of our forefathers in generations past, according to Deuteronomy chapter 26. Father, I'm asking you right now by divine edict and by gavel strike that there'll be judgments passed against the kingdom of darkness. Father God, we declare tonight that they will not reinforce force anything that we break in the mighty name of jesus father god i speak to the bodies of the individuals that are under the sound of my voice right now and every demon that is eavesdropping yes we target you we target you in the men and the women of God, in the women. We target you in their genital areas. We target, we target you in their reproductive areas. We target you, Father God. Uh, we target them, Father God, regarding uh, how they view themselves, Father God. All ancestral spirits of abandonment, gener uh, generational curses regarding, Father God, low self-esteem. We crush and we break it now in Jesus' name. All the practitioners of witchcraft, we crush your altars, we crush your black pots, we destroy your covenants, your curses, your pacts and your agreements. We annihilate and obliterate covens in the mighty name of Jesus. We release the wrecking ball in the spirit to crush your gathering places, to crush your meeting places in the wilderness, to crush where you meet, Father God, in the graveyards. We crush your meeting places and we put angels with flaming swords to prevent you from ever returning in the mighty name of Jesus. We're giving the witches an opportunity to repent tonight. The Bible says, suffer not a witch to live. You have an ability right now to accept Jesus and turn away from your black arts, your black magic. You're coming out tonight. Father, you are the giver of life and only you can give life. May your name be praised tonight, God. Father, we thank you for your mighty hand that has been protecting the people of God. We thank you for your finger and your hand of deliverance. I speak to the systems that are in operation in Crystal Lane, Esther. I command you out. I annihilate and destroy your strongholds. I crush you to dust. I kill your children. I destroy your altars. I destroy your monitoring devices. I destroy all of your accoutrements, your tools, your, rich, your ritual devices, all of your talismans and your satanic instruments. I destroy them now in Jesus' name. Every spirit under the sound of my voice operating in this woman, you're coming out. Now, we release the angels of the Lord against you with their flaming swords on sheath. We release the angels of the Lord against you. Those that have a quiver filled with arrows, we release the angels of the Lord against you. Those that ride the chariots, the assassins of the spirit. 
the reapers of the spirit, we release them against you. We release them against your rank and file. We command the kingdom of darkness to wage war against itself until there's not one man standing. Anywhere blood was shed to give you power, let the blood of Jesus speak against you. Anywhere blood was shed to give you a foothold in our lives, we revoke your ability to speak for or against that blood. Any altars in the heavens, in the earth, under the earth, in the oceans, in the seas, on the planets, on the sun, and the moon, and the stars. We crush you now in Jesus' name. Any altar that is speaking against the people of God. Regarding generational curses. Ancestral, generational, and territorial altars from across the waters. We crush and we destroy you now in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for your mercy that erase, that you choose not to remember our sins anymore. Father God, release us from inherited bondage and ancestral generational curses in the name of Jesus. Father, send your acts of fire to the foundations of our life and destroy every evil plantation in Jesus' name. Father, let the blood of Jesus flush out from our systems, every inherited satanic deposit, everything that is deposited in us, we command it out. Everything in our DNA, everything in our RNA, everything in our bloodline, everything in our bones, everything in our flesh, everything in the 12 systems in our body. You got to come out now in Jesus' name. You got to come out now in Jesus' name. Prophetess Daka, may the grace and mercy of the Lord and journey's mercies be with you as you travel, God. Lord, we release ourselves from the grips of any problems transferred into our lives. We destroy anything that wants to speak for us. Father God, let your ghost, let the Holy Ghost, let your spirit, let the Holy Spirit cleanse all of our organs now in Jesus' name. We break and loose ourselves from every inherited covenant in the mighty name of Jesus. We break and loose ourselves from inherited curses in the mighty name of Jesus. We vomit out every evil consumption that we've been fed in the spirit. Anywhere we've eaten at the enemy's table, I command our spirit man to regurgitate. I command you to spit it up. I command you to reject it. I command you to loose us from these covenants that ties us to objects and ornaments and family totems and dynastic principles and cyclical curses and calamities, cycles of calamity. We break it now. Every evil domination and control in our lives, we break. Lord, give us your blood. Give us your blood. Uh huh. I'm seeing Sangomers in Africa. Listen to me. I confront you. Yes, I'm set, setting foot on the continent of Africa. Right now, I am visiting every evil altar. And right now, I am overturning these altars. I'm visiting altars in the Caribbean right now in Jesus' name. And I'm overturning these altars. Anywhere the blood of animals, goats, and chickens was spilled to enforce covenants. Let the blood of Jesus speak for us. I go to South Africa and I overthrow these altars now in Jesus name. I go to Mozambique and I destroy these altars in Jesus name. I go to Ghana. I go to Nigeria and we destroy these altars in Jesus name. We go to Benin and we destroy these altars in Jesus name. We go to the Carolinas and Louisiana and we destroy these altars in New York, in California. All territorial spirits that are trying to arm themselves to take flight, you will not come to the rescue. You will not come to the rescue. You will not come to the rescue. We release a wall of fire against you in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, release your flamethrower. Consume everything that is looking to arm up and lace their boots up. You got to have feet to wear boots. I amputate your members now in the mighty name of Jesus. I amputate your arms. I decapitate you. I impale you on the javelin of God. Father God, we break loose 
from all foundational altars, all foundational witchcraft, all foundational spells and hexes in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the blood of Jesus cleanse us from all inherited curses. By the word of your spirit, we break every foundation generational curse over our lives. Father, the blood, we command evil covenants that are working against us to be nullified in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, by your mighty power, we break every stronghold that powers ancestral curses. We break, break, break altars, charging altars. All monitoring and communication devices, all monitoring instruments and tools, we crush and we destroy. We make our abode a no-fly zone, a no-fly zone in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, you're not going to come in here. You're not going to fly around here. You can't get to a thousand feet to us in Jesus' name, in our communities, our cities, our neighborhoods, our homes, our schools, the schools of our children, we declare that this is a beacon of light. In the mighty name of Jesus, we cancel every covenant with our firstborn. We cancel every covenant where we were the firstborn. Father, let the blood of Jesus disengage us from any initiation of blood. Anything our ancestors have done that have opened the door to our bloodline, our DNA, our RNA. We close it now in Jesus' name, Lord. We close the 12 gates. We close the gates of our bodies. We deny access and communication right now in the name of Jesus. Father, by your word, release us from every generational prison. Anywhere that we are bound in prison and cages and yokes of bondage and balls and chains, we break and we sever these, uh, uh, these primitive confining devices in the mighty name of Jesus. The Bible says who the son sets free is free indeed. Father, by your authority, we command every serpent brought by our ancestors. We destroy them now in the mighty name of Jesus. We destroy them now with the mighty name of Jesus. We break hold of any python that is at work in our lives and we crush your skull. We kill your babies. We command all spiritual babies to die. We serve all marine kingdom agents, certificates of divorcement. We remove the dowry, the jewelry, the armor, the, the drugs, the markings of demarcation. We break them now in Jesus' name. Father, let the blood of Jesus come on the scene and cancel every blood curse. Anywhere innocent blood is crying out against us, Father God, we've repented. Let not the blood speak against our finances, our resources, our health. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we break every stronghold, every foundational stronghold at work in our lives. You're fired! You are terminated. You can't work for us or against us. Father, let your blood usurp the authority of every blood covenant and we break every generational exchange. Every satanic trading floor in the mighty name of Jesus we break. Father, we thank you that our ancestral and generational curses are finally broken. And that our posterity, our children's children's children to a thousand generations will live free from the generational curses of lack and poverty. From stagnation and backwardness. From the vagabond and punery. From anti-progress and retrogression. From all manner of fear. We break these things. Right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, now I pronounce that every generational blessing that has been usurped by these curses, let it find us for generations. Father God, we call it from the east, the west, the north, and the south. We command the, 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 the bank of Beelzebub and the bank of Satan to release what God has ordained for us to have where you have gathered it by deceit. And even by our ignorance, we take back every generational curse that is assigned to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, your word declares the blessings of the Lord make it rich and add no sorrow. There is no sorrow in our life, nothing but peace and shalom in the mighty name of Jesus. And Father God, we thank you for your ability to restore. We thank you for your ability to recompense. We thank you for your ability to make wrongs right. We thank you for your ability, Father God, to order our steps and make every crooked path straight. We thank you for your ability, Father God, that you're the God of restoration. So things that we have never experienced in our life shall be so. It shall be our plight. We declare these things to be so right now in the mighty name of Jesus. And Father, we thank you. And in Jesus' name we pray. We bless you, Lord. Amen.